What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to basically tell you how to fix every kind of not launching or not starting properly issue you're currently having in satisfactory. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you will probably know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want you guys to know, let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys, you would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So the first step I would recommend doing for everybody is going to be to open up your task manager by just simply navigating down to your taskbar, right clicking it and opening up your task manager. The next step is going to be to navigate to the top left corner of your screen, clicking onto processes just to ensure that you're sticking around it. And afterwards I want you to simply click, click one of those random processes, doesn't really matter which one, and type in S in order to find satisfactory. If nothing pops up, it's good for you. If something pops up, just simply right click and enter task. Once you're finished, I want you to close the task manager. What I want you to do next is going to be to take your satisfactory or Steam shortcut right on your desktop. And if you don't have it on your desktop, simply navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen, click on the Windows symbol and use the Windows search function in order to find it. So once you found it, drag it right back on your desktop. Right click it and navigate to the very bottom where it says Properties. Once this tab pops up, I want you to click onto Compatibility and simply copy my settings. So let's quickly run through it. Compatibility mode, enable run this program in compatibility mode 4, select Windows 8, disable the disable full screen optimizations as well as enable run this program as an administrator, hit apply and OK. I would personally recommend you to restart your PC afterwards and once it is restored you should be able to see this little administrator symbol right on your shortcut. I simply want you to double click it and start your game and launch your game over the launcher or launch your game. That's it for the video, I hope they could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription, I'm gonna really be thankful for that. I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just trying to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day, see you at the next one and bye.